Pass up the Jeep, it's good to be free. Load up the pans and fishing poles. The highway is long, the wheels turning round. Pack up the cook stove and the bowls. Arlo and I, we hit the open road. Arlo and I are on the road. I'm in another one of my my wife's not here I'm in the mood to make another one of my sardine dishes so uh, today I'm going to make uh, another sort of classic French dish with a little twist on it um, I'm going to make a tomato Provencal uh, with sardines and uh, let's see today I have some Minerva sardines in tomato sauce and I also have some of these uh, espinal or um, anchovy stuffed olives. So, so I'm basically going to make a traditional French uh, tomato Provencal, which are tomatoes in the style of Provence. Um, basically um, just a uh, baked tomato with uh, breadcrumbs, garlic, um, some herbs. Um, but I'm going to uh, had, uh, have the addition of sardines and these uh, um, anchovy olives. So I guess I have uh, a little bit of Portugal, Minerva, and a little bit of uh, Spain here too. Um, so. so what I have to work with today, of course, we have our nice, ripe, beautiful tomatoes here, um, garlic, parsley, uh, some olive oil. I have some breadcrumbs here and some salt and pepper. Um, that'll all be for the topping uh, for our tomatoes um, with the addition of the uh, uh, sardines and the uh, anchovy olives. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, get our topping uh, ready first. So set all this stuff aside. So I'm going to take a little bit of this parsley here. I'm going to chop that up. Alright, that's it. So we're just going to add our uh, chopped parsley to our breadcrumbs here. Alright, and then our uh, chopped garlic. That. Some salt and pepper. and then some of our olive oil. Just like that. And we'll get our mixture together here. A little more olive oil to this. Okay. And that's our topping for our tomatoes. We'll put this aside. So the next thing we're going to do is to cut our tomatoes in half. These are nice ripe tomatoes here. Okay, and then I'm going to place them into our little baking dish here, just like that. And then add some more salt. to that, and then some more fresh ground pepper. And now, at this point, we're going to add our sardines.
So I'm going to take these sardines here and place one on top of each of our tomatoes. And it looks like there's four sardines in here, so that'll be perfect. Just like that. Set that over here. Okay. Okay, there are our tomatoes with our sardines on top, and then we're going to put our topping on top of each of the tomatoes. Just like this. Look at that. Some more on this one here. That, that looks perfect. Look at those, they look beautiful already. And then the last little addition, I'm going to add these, uh, these are anchovy stuffed olives. poured off the juice there and I put these just around here just like that just kind of evenly around look at that all right there they are I'm gonna pop these in the oven I'm gonna have this the oven set for 400 degrees and I don't know probably about uh, 20 30 minutes You're perfect tomatoes. I'm gonna take one of those out and put it on a plate here, and then maybe a few of those olives around. And then once again, I'm going to hit it with a little bit of this olive oil all the way around. And there it is. Well, there it is. Our Sardine Tomato Provençal. <laughs> Man, oh, if you could smell that right now with the, uh, just the garlic and the, uh, the sardines and the anchovy olives and all that, just that, that smell is just so So, there you go. Look at that. So let's just get into it, huh? First I'm gonna some of this uh, tomato with the sardine. This is gonna be hot because I just took it out of the oven, so. Mm. Oh, man, that is delicious. Oh, nice ripe tomatoes. Make sure you find some nice ripe tomatoes because that's key to this. I mean, it really is a tomato recipe. And those uh, anchovy stuffed olives. little powerhouses of flavor there. So these are in the oven at 400 degrees for about 25 minutes. Um, my tomatoes were sitting out so they were room temperature so they didn't have to get um, take too long to get hot. That is perfect. Oh my gosh. breadcrumbs have that nice uh, crispiness and the garlic the the, the uh, pungent garlic flavor mm. yeah. so once again sort of another uh, classic recipe um, with a sardine twist and this is tomato season now um, we're in the summer Minerva um, sardines are really nice. <clears throat> and that, now that is such a simple and delicious dish. Um, if you don't like sardines, you can leave the sardines out. I mean, just a classic tomato Provencal. Tomato, 
um, breadcrumbs with garlic and parsley, maybe some herbs, a um, little olive oil, top it, put it in the oven, um, bake it off for 25 minutes, um, and that's it. Um, you don't even need to put the uh, sardines in there, but if you're a sardine lover like I am, mm, this is definitely the way to go. Mm. Delicious. And they're beautiful. It's a nice side dish for, for something else, you know. Uh, maybe it's a side dish for a piece of meat, maybe a um, chicken or a steak or something like that, a piece, uh, piece of fish. Um, just make these uh, tomato Provencals, put it on the side. Um, with or without the, the sardines in there. Um, it's going to be perfect. Anyway, um, if you like this video, please like, uh, please subscribe. That always helps us a lot, and we'll see you in the next one. All right, bye-bye.